Hey guys and welcome back to another video with another challenge on Hitman World of Assassination. So today we're going to be doing a challenge to unlock a new outfit. We're going to be doing a nightmare in Hawks Bay. So this is using the Batch Rucken to eliminate five guards and doing it in a single session. And to unlock those Batch Rucken first you will have to complete the escalation, the Mills Revere and then once you've got it unlocked you go back you can use this to get it in your setup obviously not default and unlock finally the jacko lantern suit with the actual head on it which they should have done last year but i'm really glad they put it in this year so here's a quick guide of how to get it done straightforward from my point of view so let's get into it so starting us off we obviously start off in the bed of this unique nightmare location for Orson's nightmare and grab the spooky bat if you do want to finish this up uh, obviously just remember when you throw the truck in you will be dropping it each time so you might need to come back for it but starting off head into this first set of shrubbery bush grass whatever you want to call it and duck yourself down to hide so we're going to take this guard out first as he does turn away from us so switch into your batch rookin we are then going to jam it straight through his head obviously remember you can pick up the shruck and find them afterwards which you will need to do because you can only bring three to the level then be sure to drag his body whereas obviously you cannot get spotted whilst doing the five kills so otherwise that's a failure condition also excuse obviously the video is dark because it is a dark level because of the nightmare uh, obviously formation of this etc for the look but carrying on just keeping duck down here we're going to then take this guard out once the other guard is definitely walking away from him and again you can hide this body if you want i just took the shock in because if you take this guard out it's probably not going to spot him but just for safety i would drag him into here anyhow as you know the ai can be on this game sometimes but then making our way across we're going to wait until we're behind this guard so as he walks back you'll be able to take him out now with this guard it doesn't matter so much i mean he's out in the open generally i was going to say you shouldn't be spotted but if you want to just for safety as i did just drag his body back in see so with this one I didn't pick up the shocker but we've taken out three guards already so we only need two left now you can go off and find isolated guards at this point if you like i see i went for the quicker method for myself personally so circling around to where the two guards are digging up the grave for that person that was killed it was just easy to me to just use one of your coins or if you've got something else you can throw to distract them ping it to one side and as the one of them responds to that you can just use your shrug and you do have to be quick to do this like don't let the other guy turn around and see the body but at the same time it's not massively tight so as you see that's our last two done it's counting in the corner as you go and that's challenge completed so you have now unlocked the outfit so yeah, i will just speed up the last part i went back and got the back and finished off the level as this is quite a fun one to do and i like the fact there's a different theme than anywhere else you get in the game as well so also the added fun is the fact that you just get to whack somebody with a baseball bat which is uh so it doesn't get old too much on this game but finish it up or not the challenge is done so that leads you to the end so you'll see here i'll see it'll come the challenge completed and i'm in hawks bay and again it's a very straightforward easy one to do so the jack-o-lantern suit frighten your friends with this delightful halloween outfit featuring sturdy and elegant trench coat and an amazing lifelike jack-o-lantern mask which means we've got a new mask which means a new montage <laughs> Oh! 